Ice Cream Island. I wonder if there's ice cream on there. But no, there's no ice cream. There's literally no ice cream. It's just called Ice Cream Island. It's the same thing with, like, the, the fucking Chocolate Forest or whatever it was in Super Mario World. For sure it wasn't Chocolate Forest, but... There's, like, Cookie Dough Plains or... Or Donut Plains. Donut Plains. Cookie Dough Plains. Man, I would like to see that. Yeah, that's right, I can't drop down. Let's get the juice. Come here. Man! Parasol! Yay! I'm ready to beat the shit out of Peach. Peach, where are you? Come here. I'm gonna whack you with this. Fun fact for the day, the parasol in the night in the middle of the 19th century was was used to keep sun out of sun out of out of the fair maiden's eyes and out, and off of her fair skin. But it was also used because people would throw their shit out the window after they were done shitting. So it was also to protect from that. That is true. <laughs> Man, fucking Victorian era, massive, great, great extensions of technology and stories and literature and architecture. Also, it had people throwing shit out the window. <laughs> It's fun looking at history because the Renaissance was amazing. It was an amazing time and an amazing. Oh, dude, wind! Dude, I'm Airbender. Cora, I can help you out, bro. Or sis, whatever. Fucking dude, I'm doing. I'm an Airbender. Wait for the Fire Nation to attack, man. <laughs> I'm trying all I can. Where's Tenzin? Probably off being a bitch. All right. Uh <laughs> 5,000 points, great. Can it heal my bleeding wounds? Probably not. But oh well. I farted. You didn't have to hear that. I'm sorry. Egg catcher! Catch the eggs or else... Oh, hey, it's Didi. What's going on, man? Oh, 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 oh. Wow! <laughs> that was quick! <laughs> I didn't even know what I was doing. You know, it's kind of disturbing that the eggs, they're kind of hatching. It's not like the raw eggs, where it's like refrigerated eggs, because the yolk is already dead. But, uh, oh yeah, I was gonna suck that guy up, and then I remembered I had Tornado. TORNADO! But yeah, since those eggs were about to be hatched, is he eating live chicks? Jesus Christ, there's no end to his fucking insanity. Uh, yay, star! Come here. Warp star! Where are we going? We're going to the desert island? We're going to the desert? We're going to Super Mario Land? No? Alright. Where's the fucking... The... I forgot the name of it. Fire Nation, kill him! Fire! 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 Kill him! Alright, alright. Dude, it's a giant wheel! And... Holy fuck, he's already almost dead. Stop it. Kick! Come here. Oh, you're- you're dick. Come here. Fine. See how that is. And I'm gonna take your power. How about that? How is that man able to use my uh, abilities? It's because I sucked up your father. Sorry, kid. It's just part of the job. We. Wheel's one of my favorite powers in, uh, in Kirby history, but... The only times you can effectively use them are sometimes a little bit too situational. Like, every time you you see a wheel power-up, there's almost always a part where it's just like a long stretch where you can use the wheel power-up. But other than that, there's not a lot of use to it. I just like moving around without using the D-pad because I'm a lazy fuck. <laughs> That's the real reason. Yay, I, I took away his parasol and I murdered him. Dude, I can't go in the water? Aww. Oh, there's probably something over there. There was probably something over there! How about we speak like a regular person? Ah, uh, no. Alright. <laughs> get- hit the fucking- You're a fucking loser. Get- get- God damn it! Oh, you're annoying. Oh. Oh. Oh, is this how it's gonna be? Fucking hit the- <sighs> The sword guy is- The knight over there is just like, what is he doing? I don't get it. I want sword. Welp. Apparently, the powers have a fear of needles. Because that was interesting. 
like it hit the. Uh, can I? Can I? No. Nope. All right. Wee. Dude, that's like a slide dash. You can also use a sword underwater. I don't know how it's any effective because fucking you know buoyancy is gonna kill that. Unless you're in any anime where they forget about that. <laughs> you know those massive underwater fights that happen all the time. It's just like you know there's buoyancy, right? Whatever strength you're putting into that three three mile long sword is cut probably in is cut by probably three quarters. There's a lot of water. It cuts your power, man. I wish there was logic in anime because then I'd, I'd be able to enjoy it. Those really crazy anime and mangas are starting to wear off, though. Don't don't hit me. Thank you. I, I, you're dead. <laughs> Meta Knight, are you gonna give me more in invincibility? No. But but you helped me out last time. Yeah. But but you helped me out last time. So? You helped me out last time. How many times do I have to say it? What is wrong with you? Yeah, I'm murdering all his... All his... I want Antenna... I want Antenna... Bende... Oh, jeez! That guy came out of nowhere! Alright, you gotta time it. Nope! Come here. Yeah, I killed all of them with one health. I don't need. I, I. It doesn't matter if I need one health. It's like AC four and three and four. Fuck. All right, maybe not. It's like AC three and four. Fucking one health doesn't matter. Beat the shit out of all the fucking British, except for the grenade ear, because that guy knows how to fucking block. What if those soldiers watch the grenade ears? Like the grenade ear in three is that guy with a giant axe and the fucking kilt. Um. Uh. He, you know, Connor goes for the main kill. He just catches his arm and headbutts him. You ever think the soldiers are looking at him and like, Holy shit, I never thought about that. That's amazing. Anyway, we're playing Kirby. Uh, so yeah, the copy ability is uh, synonymous with Kirby. I, I like the copy ability. It's very gr Ow. It's very grand. Uh, dude, what does is, what is this guy do? Nothing. <laughs> I like how there's just some of the- some of those enemies were just like, oh, they don't really give you powers. And there's always those enemies in Kirby. You know I always hate it when there's enemies in Kirby's- in Kirby where they don't have copy abilities. And that annoys me. Is there a certain criteria that they have to go through to actually get the copy ability? Is DDD like, nah, you're not- you're not special enough. We're gonna give the copy ability to the gumdrop that can fucking shoot lightning. <laughs> Ah, alright, okay. Don't worry about it. I got seven lights. Fire Nation! Oh, dude, Rocky! Give me that. It's Sir Rock, or Samurai Rock. Bleh. Is it always Rock this time? Yeah. Oh, dude, it's Timey McTimerson! Or, he's making notes? What? That's not what a clock does! Don't go away. Hey, yeah! Man, I just... What I like about Rock the most is that you can just thrust forward with it. I'm gonna murder him with this. Dude, what power do I get? I get Mike. Okay. <laughs> Bizarre. I mean, the alarm clock kind of fits, but he looks more like a clock and not an alarm clock. Oh well. Mike. Do I get three uses with this one? Yeah. Just making sure. Nope. Yeah, yay. I used the megaphone first and then the actual mic. Fuck. Wonder if I could suck it up again and then get another three. Fucking. That's a no, by the way. <laughs> Solve that problem. You got questions? I'll answer them. Oh, dude, I can shoot lasers out of my hand. That's actually a lot cooler than when when it's like not that. Because man, that lag. They're not shooting carrots anymore, but. Fucking, they're shooting out the diamonds in the sky. All right, I'll go with it. Again, the same thing with uh, with wheel. The laser is kind of situational. It doesn't have a lot of area of effect, except for pinpoint precision. Which, thankfully, this game controls well. 
for the most part. <laughs> There's a couple times where I hit the button and nothing happens. And I go straight to my death. What is with the Hershey drop that shoots electricity? Spark! Oh, it's called Spark. Another game is called Plasma. Then they move it back to Spark. Or maybe that's just the enemy called Plasma. No, that's... He's called something else. Can't remember. I can't remember all of these enemies. There's too many enemies to memorize, man. Yeah, I did it. I did it. I, I did it. Don't go into four! Great. Thank God I could do that. I was kind of scared about that. Going to the stage, I can't leave. I have to go do this all again. Can you shoot me if I go up here? Hey. Hey, what's up? What's going on? So, uh... <sniffs> yummy, yummy! And I'm gonna murder you. <laughs> Why? I have to fill my lust. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Alright, let's go to stage five. And I think after the boss, I'm gonna call it quits. Oh well. I'm having so much pun playing. So much pun? So much pun playing, Kirby. I mean, what is with the fatness? I mean, um. The one time I need a pun to make the joke work, it doesn't happen. Hey! Because I need the pun, I guess when when I when, when I can't think about it, when I'm not good about doing the right thing, I'm barking up the wrong tree or blowing up the wrong tree. Fuck it, I I don't care. I'm gonna I'm gonna go and kill myself. But no, don't don't lose it. Don't don't do that. Please don't. Mario. Oh well. Oh, dude, that dude is green. He was green with envy. These enemies are green. I don't know why. Also, you can't jump with a wheel, which makes me sad. Don't, don't lose it. The thing I hate the most is that sometimes when you get hit, you lose the power. And other times, you do it. It was high jump. I don't really need it. It's more of a horizontal kind of thing going on. Don't stop. Hit the clock. I hit the clock a while ago. There's no clocks here, though. Time is endless here. Ah, Gordo. Go, Gordo, go away. They just have to have imperv impervious enemies all the time in every game ever made. There's always enemies that are just like, nah, you're not gonna get any anywhere through. All right, let's not go up that way. Because that, those are some crash. That is, that is the crash power up. Oh no. Ha. Huh. He killed his friend. I should have gotten, oh, oh, dude, tomato. Fuck. I got hurt. Oh, tomato, give me that. Oh, I already have full health anyway. Apple, give me that. Oh, nope, it just blew up. All right. Little known fact, you shoot apples with stars, they blow up. The hard part is getting your hands on a star. Because they're hot. Like, really hot. I mean, they're like the sun hot. That's literal. I mean, they're actually very hot. Apparently, if a star blows up... You're just like, oh, the star blew up. It vanished. Apparently, it didn't actually blow up right then. It blew up like a million years ago. <laughs> and we just saw it. Talk about a life. You blow up, wait a few million years, and then people notice. Fucking people listen to you when you're dead. That's like that one song. Dude, it's a car. What a painter, man. It's always kind of weird. There's always, like, this one... There's a lot of stuff where there's an enemy or an ally or some character in any kind of story where they draw things to life. That seems like to... That seems to be some kind of current... Ow! That seems to be some kind of... Uh... Normal thing. Or not normal. Just... Ow! Stop hating me! Oh, dude, it's Mike. Gimme. Gimme. Kill him. Ow. You fuck. Kill him. Yeah, I murdered him. One more time. Get the mic. Make out with the mic. It'd be like Kiss. Be like Janine Roberts. What? <laughs> Fucking jeez. <laughs> what am I talking about? Alright, guys. That was Kirby's adventure. I'll join you next time while Kirby falls off and gets hit by a bomb. Oh, no. 
and he's dead. That's actually the end of the game. So uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna see Kirby ever again. Those other Kirby games, it's a descendant. So that's how it works.